Dad. He's okay. Rick? No, Alan. I t thought you were here to see Alan. Hey, Frank. Are we through? Because I've got people to see, places to go. Not until we know you're okay. You're a lucky man, Mr. Spaulding. Lucky, huh? Keep an eye on your granddad. So thank you again. Uh, you heard the man. We're out of here. Come on. Look, I could walk. It's just across the street. Okay, we're going to find Buzz. Okay, we're going to get you out of here. We're going to take you home. And I, I need some backup. Yeah, and I need a witness to prove to your mother I haven't lured you into the world of corporate greed. We're not worrying about my mother right now. We're worrying about you. I'm all right. I told you. I'm Alan, fine. You had me worried back then, okay? Are you all right? What happened? Beth, don't tell me they called you too. Look, I don't want everyone to get upset over nothing. Nothing? No. But from what I heard, you could have been killed. It was like this close. Close only counts in horseshoes and elections in Florida. He says he has meetings or something, I don't know. Meeting? Well, we can forget that. We're taking you home. Where's Peyton? She's, she's here or she will be any minute. Are you all right? Doctor said I'm going to live forever. It's not, it's not exactly what he said, no. Well, he should have said that because that's the truth. I always did believe you had nine lives. But somebody up there must be really looking out for you. <sighs> okay, come on, I'll I'll walk you out. There's no rush, Buzz. The doctor said you need to rest, all right? You're my grandson, not my mother. Hey, hey look, hey, you hungry? Me? Yeah, you. Yeah, always. All okay, right. come on. Like, just... could afford a lawyer. Yeah. I still wouldn't see you. Gee, can I have that in writing? I got a handshake. Huh? I, did you, are you sure that that roof didn't hit you like a wee wee bit? No, you know? no, no. I'm, I'm fine. Huh. What do you say? Uh, what do you say we move this? Oh thing? no, the city's gonna take care of that. The city, the city hasn't finished the Thornton Street Bridge in ten okay, years. Well, let Frank and Cope do it. No, 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 no. What if somebody came by and got hurt like a stranger? Huh? Oh, are you gonna? Are you, are you gonna ask me what day it is? And I'm gonna tell you it's Christmas. And you're gonna send me out to buy a turkey. Is that what you know? What's going on? Humbug. Come on. Here, I'm just watching you. Hey, oh, folks. Excuse me. You want to go back to the hospital? <laughs> Excuse me. Look, why don't you get over here and help us or get out of here? One of the two. Come on. All right, ready? One, two, let's go. Let's go. All right, that's it. <laughs> All right, thank you. Did 
you do? What? No. What are you doing? They're mine. Don't take all. Don't. Stop. Don't be an idiot. What the hell are you thinking? What about your daughter? Oh, you honestly, you think I was trying to just get her? No, listen. Yeah, I'm um, trying to. Oh. Are you moving now? Oh, I'll take please. you to the ER, get your stomach pumped. Ew! You're not getting my stomach pumped. Listen to me, I'm trying. God, poor girl, life is so hard. It's unfair. It's unfair for everybody. You just let's go. Keep moving. What are you talking about? Listen, I'm trying to. I... Look, I didn't eat, okay? I didn't eat, and I took the pills I forgot to eat, and so I'm tired, okay? You're right? tired. I know, you're tired of life, you're tired of living, you're tired of fighting. You know what? Your daughters want you to live. I know! All right, well, then move. Would you stop? Keep no, moving. just. Wait, I. Stop it! I didn't try to kill myself. That bottle is empty. The pills, they fell on the floor earlier. I didn't feel like picking them up. I was waiting for the maid. Okay, and the phone call about Emma and the just in case? Just in case I fell asleep, not just in case I croaked, right? I'm, I'm sleepy, I'm not suicidal. Don't turn this into a movie of a week. I just got my chest unzipped. Okay, it hurt, so I took a pill. Maybe two. I'm sleepy, okay? That's all. Get out. I'm just gonna take the rest of these pills. No, just get out. I will leave when I take the rest of those pills. Because you're going to stay alive whether you like it or not. Hey, 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 hey. You know, the idea is to clean, not to break. Maybe we should have made him go lie down or rest or something. Alan, make him. It doesn't work that way. I don't know. The roof may not have hit him, but something did. I'm telling you, he's acting, he's, he's acting weird, man. Yeah, he's acting weird, isn't he? I kind of prefer this one to the old one. I'm sorry. I'm Look, so sorry. I'll I'm sorry. clean. I'll clear it. Come over here. I'm gonna do the applications. All right. Uh, no, this one is. This one is Michael Carson, 2-2 two, two average, no, no, we mixed him. Actually, I've, I've, I've been thinking. What? Should I worry? <laughs> That's <laughs> funny. No. Um... <laughs> it was funny. It was funny. <laughs> no, um, it was like... It was like right after, um, right before Christmas break. And, um, I was in math class with Mr. Big, the math teacher. And he was up at the board, and out of nowhere, he just like... Bam, he just like... Plopped down, face first, you know? He died? No, he didn't. He didn't die. He, um, he had a heart attack. Wow, you guys must have been scared. What? Yes, we froze. We were all at our desks. Like, I don't know what to do. I was waiting for the guy to jump back up or something. And Mike just flies out of his desk, flies out of his chair, and just starts pounding on Mr. Bick's chest. You know, like CPR and the whole deal. Did it work? Bick's still handing out C's. He gave a seat to Mike Carson, the guy that saved him? What I'm, what I'm trying to say is, um, like when it came down to it, Mike was the only one that, that got out of his seat. He's the only one that, that moved, that did something. Okay, then. One of those guys that surprises you, like somebody else I know. So I think Mike Carson goes to the top of the pot. Agreed. Agreed. All right, there. Go on. Oh, I'll ask you to be here. Oh, no one. Well, there you go. So, if you don't mind, I've got things to do. Yeah, like what? Like, um, why are you smiling? What is that? Is that reverse psychology? Is that it, what that is? Is it working? Not so much. Mm -hmm. Listen, I don't need a nanny or a nurse. Are you, okay? Ladies. Fabulous. What? Oh. Oh, no, that's good. Good timing, because maybe you can talk some sense. What's wrong? You remember in, in The Wizard of Oz when the, the house fell on the wicked witch? Yeah, it almost happened to me. But it wasn't a house, it was just a section of the roof. A, a company, I know, I saw that. Yeah. I was, I was uh, coming down the stairs and I fell and, and it missed me by inches. Have you seen a doctor? Yeah. He said I was lucky to be alive. Well, they love to say that. But it wasn't luck. What happened it goes against everything I, 
I've ever thought. Uh, like uh, voting for a Democrat? Look, I, uh, I won't blame you for doubting this. I, I doubt it myself, but you're the only two people I could tell who wouldn't think I'm crazy. And I want you to convince me that I'm not. <laughs> Go ahead. Don't, don't, don't encourage him.